GTA Swift Gamery and welcome back to another video here on my channel. In today's GTA 5 video we're just upgrading the APC tank here in Grand Theft Auto Land and also telling you the discounts when there's not many but I'll be telling you anyway in this video today. If you go on to like this video, you know what to do, smash that like button, subscribe if you are brand new to our community and also hit that little bell next to your name so you out in the future content just like this here in my channel. And also, as always, I've got some comments and questions which was added on my previous video. If you open your comments and questions added to the next video, go down in the comment section down below, add your comment right there, and I'm sure to add it in the very next video here on my channel. And also, I'm still testing some glitches out, so probably a little bit of while to go before I upload in any more glitches. Probably in the next two days or something, I'll surely have something for you but if something automatically comes out i'll sure to post it but anyway we need to get on with today's video so let's get on with it in today's video we are upgrading the apc tank something that some of you guys would probably want to look into just because i don't know you might be interested in buying the apc tank but you're not really too sure if you should buy it or not. Well, the good point of actually buying it in the APC tank is you can actually spawn it and you can actually put it inside of your garage. Okay, would that be the CEO garage? Or you can put it in any of your apartments. Okay, you don't, it's not limited to whatever you need to put it into. It is simple. You can stick it inside any of your garages or apartments so that's one good thing about the APC tank okay now I will be making another video in the next coming days unfortunately I'm not sure if you can use them in missions or not um, now that's something you'll have to quote me on but I'm not really too sure but I will make an updated video but let's get this in the mobile operations center. Obviously, you need the operation, mobile operations center to upgrade these vehicles. Okay, so we're just spawning inside. First thing is first, we're going to stick 100% armor on that baby. Then we're going to put the race brakes for that one. And then we're going to put level 4 engine. Okay, and then we're going to put the horn as the San Andreas loop horn. Okay, and then we're going to put the lights as, you know, the normal standard bluey lights. Okay, and then we're going to put a livery on there. Now, the, this livery, Sanku door, seems okay, but I think that's what I will go for because none of these other ones actually look decent for the tank. So, I think I'm going to go back to the Fort Sanku door one. Or the Sankudo one just up there. I did have a look at a couple, but some of them just don't. I mean, that one looks good, but I think I'll just stick with the Sankudo one right there. Okay, so I'll just stick with that one for now, and then we don't we don't need that one. We don't need definitely proximimes. I'm gonna make this color blue. Okay, blue is my favorite color. Now, I will most probably change it to either like purpley blue, just because that most probably would be best. Um, but yeah, we'll stick it to blue for now, and we're not going to sell it. We're going to put the transmission as race transmission. We're definitely going to put turbo on this. Weapons. I'm going to put the SAM turret battery on there, but I will probably leave it to the stock one. The windows, um, or the wheels, I'm definitely going to put this on high end and then I'm going to put them on stock and then I'm going to put them on solar for that one right there. And then I'm going to go all the way back to the colour and I'm going to put um, probably a brighter blue uh, colour on there. Yeah, bright blue, maybe baby blue, no, bright blue, blue would be good on that one tyre designs definitely on that one and bulletproof tyres already come with it and the smoke will definitely go with blue on that one and windows will go fully limb yeah definitely and that is it 
we fully customized that baby so now let's see how it does perform now the good thing and the bad things of this okay now obviously with the sand battery okay the ones that I've got right now these can only hold 60 rockets okay 60 rockets okay now if that's good enough to take a tank down you're probably more so likely to be able to take two tanks down but 60 rockets is a maximum for this baby okay now you're probably thinking how do we upgrade it you know how, how do we get more rockets well there's two different ways that you can do it you can put your personal vehicle back into storage from the MC menu okay or you can simply call out your mobile operation center and stick it inside the LSC bit right there and as soon as you get into the menu just simply back out of it and it should also have 100% 60 rockets be able to right there okay now you're probably thinking how many rockets sticky bombs or god knows what does this take I will make another video for that okay I don't want to crumb everything in one video so what I'm doing is upgrading these vehicles all these vehicles not in 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 alphabetical order but I will be upgrading all these vehicles okay first and then what I'll do is also test out how these do perform with the likes of sticker bombs RPGs homing launchers buzzards jets you name it we'll find it but yeah that is it for upgrading the uh, APC tank if you think it's a good vehicle go out and go and buy it but it really is expensive so if you do want to go and buy it you surely can but it's a little bit too expensive so you might just want to do some selling missions and maybe some stealing to be able to you know get at least your money some money first before you go out and go and buy it but if you've got the money go out there it's a brilliant vehicle you might be able to take a check a tank a, a jet or two down and maybe a tank okay so now we are actually moving on or what is the discount some more which is going on right now okay so the first thing is first for a limited time you can log in to Grand Theft Auto Online to unlock both blue and red class of 98 t-shirts okay so that's really really good there if you want one of them you surely can and also you can actually unlock a black bomb cap which is that's you can unlock that by purchasing a bunker okay and you'll also score a white Harwick and little hoodie which you can get them from from any of the clothing stores and also any other stores around Los Santos and Main County. Now let's move on to the actual discounts. There's literally not many, but there is a couple of discounts which is going on all the way through until tomorrow. Tomorrow is the last day for the discounts. So let's get on with them. So the weapons, ammo and vehicle sale all the way through till June the 19th okay which is tomorrow so you'll have one last day tomorrow to get these okay the have the ability to upgrade the customized selected weapons from your new mobile or operation center and the ammunition for them weapons is offering 25% off the following newly upgraded okay so that will be the pistol the SMG combat MG, the assault rifle and also the heavy sniper okay all standard ammunitions is also 25% off okay so that's a really really good good moment right there if you really do want to actually you know 
get some ammunition because that's really really epic 25% off all ammunition and also at the legacy motor spokes that is offering 25% off discounts on the FMJ and also the adder okay and that will be going on all the way through until the 19th so literally not many days to go but it will probably more slightly get some more discounts which will be coming on but as soon as we do i'll surely to update you and any you know double cash and rp opportunities but there is literally no double cash and rp opportunities or anything like that it's just these selected vehicles and also the weapons as well and the ammo which is also going off right there so there's not that many to actually go through but it's still a nice opportunity to actually get some ammo if you need to okay so that's all good right there but yeah that is typically it for the you know the discounts and more and also upgrading the lovable vehicle of our brand new well i wouldn't say really brand new but yeah the apc tank right though there is so uh, ins and outs of these vehicles obviously you can purchase them from warstock cash and carry okay pretty much expensive and obviously they can be stored in your personal garages as i previously said before okay and you call them up anytime through your mechanic okay or obviously if you already had one you can call it out with the interaction menu by requesting personal vehicle and it will should arrive also the goods and bads i would say we're not really too sure if you can or can't use them in missions also but i will be testing them out every single video i will make a video of every single vehicle that you can use inside of a mission but i'm not really too sure about heists because we all know them heists are different to missions but you never know we might be able to or we might not be able to because we all know rockstar likes limiting us where and where can't we obviously get our vehicles from okay and yeah that is typically it really um that's all the discounts which is going on right now and um, we've also upgraded that vehicle right there i've got done a couple more vi vi videos coming up really really soon so you really do want to check them out all we're doing in the next coming weeks or days shall i say we're just upgrading these vehicles and then we're also returning the explosive proof of these vehicles okay to see if it is definitely worth to buy it because we all know you know some of these vehicles might be good but you don't want to be hanging around in these vehicles if they do get blown up and obviously do not blow anyone's personal vehicle because some of these are a hefty bill so if you want a hefty bill blow them up but i wouldn't advise you to blow them up because it's a really really a hefty bill and obviously that's something you don't typically want but yeah I'm out ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for watching and as always again if you've got any contents, any glitches or anything that you have or you might see a video of that you don't typically, you know, you know a glitch that you know you want to share out to the community then all you need to do is go down in the description down below my email address is there, you don't have to be the founder or you can be a founder show send me your video right there and also a link to your youtube channel so i can give you some credit for that video and so we can share out glitches to the whole community as always and also as well there is a couple of money glitches but i'll try and get them out as tomorrow at the earliest if i possibly can so stay tuned for them i will most definitely try to get them out tomorrow if rockstar hasn't patched them that is okay and also there is a loads and loads of glitches but some of them are just typically useless 
but yeah i'm out ladies and gentlemen thank you very much for watching this video take care and i'll see you in the next video here on my channel i hope you're having a good day i hope your dad's had a good day but anyway let's get on and let's end this video thanks for watching guys i'll see you in the next one bye guys